Hello everyone and welcome to Do You Copy, a indie horror game that I'm actually very interested in playing because I've never seen anything like it. So let's go ahead and dive right in. I should probably uh, get my headphones on. With a name like Do You Copy, I think the headphones might be a little bit important. All right, so I've never once played this, but I know the basic premise of it. Oh my gosh, I am lagging like crazy. Oh, now I'm not. Okay. Um, doesn't look like there's a sprint function, so basically we're like a park ranger or something, and we're stationed here at this watchtower, and we have to guide a camper who's lost through the woods to safety. So there's another tower up there. Uh, so let's go, have, go ahead and have a look inside here. Ah, uh, so here's our radio. Can we use the radio? All right, well this should be interesting. Also, there's a door here. Yeah, but I've barricaded the windows up, and you'll find out why soon. I'm not sure why there's a bed, though. Are we supposed to be, like, staying here overnight? I guess we are supposed to be staying here overnight, but I can't imagine we're supposed to be sleeping on the job, are we? All right, well, I'm ready. Tower four, this is tower two. Right on cue. I am here. Tower four, this is ta tower two, this is tower four. I copy. Over. All right. Park's all mine, huh? Cool, so it looks like everything is going well so far. My performance issues have subsided. The park is all ours. That guy has left and is going home to his wife. And we are here in the spooky park alone, gazing off into the mountains, the trees, and the lakes. So yeah, this is Indy. I got, ooh. Hello? 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 That's our cue. Is anyone there? Yeah, hi. Um, copy, this is Tower 4, over. I, I, I saw this channel listed over the trails out here. I need you to help me. All right, we'll help you. What's that say? I'm lost and something is chasing me. Please, you have to help me. Oh boy. Could you imagine if this actually happened to you? Uh, calm down, you need to stay calm. Where are you? Over. I don't know. Something started chasing me, so I started running. You have to help me. I'm going to die out here. Oh my goodness. He's panicking. Okay, um, I'll turn on the floodlights. Over. Okay, so I guess the switch for that is out here. I feel like there should be a sprint function, but for this kind of game, it seems kind of, uh, oh, use breaker. Ah, there we go. Okay, what's this say? Attention, I can't read it, it's too dark. Uh, switch is broken, needs to be held in place. Park service is notified, I think it says. Can I turn this up? Is there any, ooh. Look, I, I don't know what happened back there. Okay. Oh my gosh, look at all these bottles. I better not be drunk. Man. Oh, examine map. Okay, that might be useful. Uh, yeah, I cannot read any of this. Uh, Gracewind Lake Pass, I think it says. Gracewind Lake. Ah. Uh. Alright, well, this is pretty good so far. Can we take a nap? Oh man, I'm a terrible housekeeper. My gosh, look at this. Alright, well, I cannot sleep. I cannot sit down. Oh, hello. Oh. What should I do? Uh, Carnation Rock Trail. Is that right here? Yeah, I think so. Um, leaving, uh, take the left path, I guess? Uh, oh no, he's right here. Um, stay on that path. Stay on that path. Uh, quickly. Uh, okay, take the left path. Okay. Can we actually see him walking out here? And do I have a flashlight? I could use a flashlight, because everything is so dark. Um... There might be a brightness options, but I'm too scared to pause it to try to push escape because oftentimes escape actually exits the game, like in Five Nights at Freddy's or in Slender. Man, that takes me back. Anyone else getting kind of Slender vibes? I guess it is like Slender, except we're guiding someone else through the woods. That's pretty interesting. All right, I'm going to turn it up as much as I can as well. Not as much as I can, but oh. Okay, I think I'll turn it back down, thank you. Can we, uh, answer that? Oh man, I can't even use the radio now. Aw, oh, this is getting creepy. Alright, so he- I should probably be marking his progress. So he went there, I think? Maybe he's there? I don't know. I can't tell. I can tell where he is. Ah, oh, this is just spooky. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Oh man, this music is not comforting at all. Uh, whoever did the music for this did a great job. I have every right to say that, being a musician. Or an aspiring musician. Alright, what's going on here? Man, this is creepy. Woo! Oh, is that him? Did you hear that? Dude! 
We can see it. That is cool. Okay, so if he's there, and we are this tower right here, then he must be right there. So I'm kind of on the right track. Okay, um, can I talk to him though? Uh, it's just a tree falling, don't worry about it. Oh gosh. Hey, how's it going? Okay. That's good. Oh, okay, that's bad. Why are my lights kind of dimming a bit? Uh, what do you see? Any landmarks? Okay. Okay, so he's probably right there. All right. Gosh dang. Okay. Um, go toward the mine, I guess. I'll tell him to go uh, head toward the, go towards the mine. Head toward the lake. It'll put you back on the. Uh, I'll tell him to head toward the lake. Actually, that sounds like a better. Because I believe we're trying to get him to tower two. Whoa. What is this? Full Metal Alchemist. Look at these symbols here. Is that tic tac toe? <laughs> Found a little tic tac toe Easter egg there. Oh man, this is incredible. What's this? What are these things? Oh man. Oh. Oh, it's an elk. That's an elk noise. I know what that is. Um, and look at all this stuff here. Uh, oh, we can examine it. Uh, examine? Oh, man. While the community still tries to recover from the horrible crimes perpetrated by Michael Leeds, the still fresh wound has been made even more stinging by the fresh rush of disappearances. Since the beginning of this summer, no fewer than four overnight visitors at Two Grace Wind Park have gone missing. Multiple sightings of a large bipedal animal watching the hikers from the trees have been uh, have been dismissed by local officials as bear sightings. And the park services have been issued and have officially have issued an official warning about the avoiding the animals. Okay. Ah, uh, so this is the goat man. I guess this is the monster that everyone's trying to avoid. All right, looks like there's like a bat type thing. Oh man, this is incredible. What's this? Oh man, Sasquatch sighting, hoax or missing link. A local man on Carnation Rock Trail in Gracewind Park reported seeing a large bipedal animal while briefly separated from his hiking group last week. Tuma may concern stop putting cardboard cutouts of movie monsters in the woods. Regards, Park Services. Man, I haven't heard from the guy in a while. I hope I didn't mess up somehow. That would mean his death is on me. Oh, this is some heavy concepts here. Oh, man. Until further notice, the Gracewind, Par the Gracewind Lake Pass is off limits to all visitors due to multiple reports of bears in the vicinity. Ooh. Please use the alternate path. Oh, marked on your map. Oh, wait, hang on. If, I if he's supposed to be using an alternate path... Whoa! Oh, it's just a tree. I thought there was something out there. Are you oh. watching the lake? Oh, what about it? What? Whoa. Oh. That time, I know I saw something. That was definitely eyes. I totally saw eyes there. Oh, man. This is, this is creepy, man. This is just terrible. I've clearly barricaded up, so I know what's going on. I seem to be collecting everything that uh, has to... Oh, no. There's missing people and everything. I seem to be collecting everything that uh, has to do with this guy. Oh, uh, that's crazy. Okay, well, hang on. Um, where's the guy? I haven't heard from the guy in ages. Oh, there he is. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, man. So I guess that's like the goat man talking to us or something? Oh, man. Or Bigfoot or whatever it is? I don't know. I guess it's not... Oh, uh, yeah. Where is he? Where is he supposed to... B. I told him to go toward the lake, so it might be about there, I hope. I don't know. I'm putting too much wishful thinking into this. Hang on. Because I know I think we're supposed to get him up here. Maybe we're supposed to get him down to us. Oh, I don't know. But if the if the Bigfoot guy or goat man... Okay, where are you? Looks like I'm getting on to Gracewind Lake Pass. Hmm. This, uh... How much longer till I'm over here? Gracewind Lake Pass, huh? That's right. Uh oh. Okay, uh, keep on that trail. Keep on that trail. Just keep on the trail. It should right. take you right See to you the tower. Now. Okay. Cool. Good. Ah oh, man, this is just this is creepy. All stuck. Oh no. This is not. Hello. 
Hello? Hi, can I say anything back to you? Can I mess with the knobs? I can't. Can I take a drink? Whoa! That sounded way too close for comfort, man. I do not like that. What? No. No. Oh. Oh, man. This is spooky. This is spookier than I thought it'd be. Hello? Hi. See you soon. Oh no, is that the guy who said he'd see me soon? The goat man? Ah oh, man. Okay, well, Grace Wind Park. Uh, oh, 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 hang on, what I do? Oh, missing, another hiker lost in Grace Wind Park. Tragedy is once again strike. I, it's hard to read this because it's just slightly pixelated for me. Tragedy has once again struck in Gracewind Park as another visitor goes missing. The Gracewind Park services is oh I messed up didn't I? The Gracewind Park services issued an official statement claiming that the individual in question was the victim of a bear attack, and that some of his personal effects were collected at the Gracewind Pass. Ooh, okay, so I messed up. That's not good. Oh man, look at that note on the side. Is it 1999? Are those nines? Those are the weirdest nines I've ever seen. 1999, eight missing so far. How many more this year? Okay, so this takes place in 1999. Crucial information. Uh, 1945, 17 missing on one trail. 1918, insufficient evidence that the local library needs better records. Okay. Uh, the park ranger on duty that night, however, claims that there is more to the story in an exclusive interview. They claim there was some kind of monster imitating the lost man's voice over the radio, which is true. And while that may sound unbelievable to some of you out there, we here at the Midnight Star are no stranger to bizarre stories coming from the Grace Wind Park. Oh, this game is a masterpiece. I'm going to play it again. I'm going to try to... Um, I'm gonna play it again in the future. I'm gonna try to actually, um, try to actually make the guy live and not lead him to his death, because I take full responsibility for that. As drastic as it sounds, I was the one who inevitably led him to his death. This game is really, really well done. I am very, very proud of you guys at Space Octopus Studios for putting this together. Down there you can see that is actually the name of the game company. I am so glad I had a look at this game. This is really incredible, and I hope you guys like it. So anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. And if you liked it, please click the like button. Over. And if you like the channel, please subscribe. Thanks again for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye!